Hey guys, what's up? It's me again, Tom from TTT Tom's Tech Time. Welcome to a new episode of mine. Today I want to briefly explain how to install third-party apps to the brand new DJI Smart Controller because after filming my review, I received quite a few questions regarding that. Let's get this episode started. Don't forget to leave a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. And if you subscribe, don't forget to tick the little bell icon to never again miss any of my upcoming drone-related episodes. I have so many already now. Don't forget to subscribe. It is worth it. Let's get this episode started. At first, open up your browser and go to the Google Play Store. Find the app that you're looking for. Right-click and copy the URL. Next, open up Google and look for an APK downloader. There are several. A link can be found in the description below this video as well. Right-click and paste your link. And click at Generate Download Link. Finally, download the generated file. Now, insert a microSD card into your computer and copy the downloaded APK file onto the microSD card. Remove the card from the computer and insert it into the remote control. Tap at the symbol with the four squares in the bottom right and open the file manager. Next, tap at installation package. And double tap on the app file that you want to install. Now, follow the on-screen instructions and wait a few seconds during the installation. Finally, you can click open to run the downloaded app. If you later want to open the app again, tap at the symbol in the bottom right. And ta-da! Here is the installed app that you can use at any time from now on. Thank you guys for watching my video. If there is still something unclear, then don't forget to leave a comment below this video. And right now, it is the perfect time to click at the red subscribe button below this video to never again miss one of my upcoming drone and drone related videos. I have so many already now online and more will be coming. And I can promise you this, it is gonna be exciting. Now click the subscribe button and right next to it, there is a bell icon. You should tick that as well because otherwise YouTube is just not gonna send you any notifications. It is a double thing. You always have to click the button and the bell. And I think that many people don't know that. Actually, I didn't know that until a few months ago. That's how it is. Life is hard. Now don't forget to check out one of my other videos or maybe show up on tomstechtime.com. There's an amazing blog. There is drone pilots apparel. That's awesome drone shirts and so much more. Check it out. Stay tuned and fly safe.